Now I've got next to me Stevie Hall, and him and his wife have really uh, done a fantastic job with this year's Songwriters Festival. Thank you, Randy. Thank you very much. I'm glad you're here. Oh, glad well, thank you. It's my here. pleasure. Yeah, I'm glad everybody's turned out. It's a real good turnout, and uh, uh, we filled up seven stages, I think we have, 31 artists, and uh, this is only 15 seconds of fame because i got to go on. Yeah, I know. <laughs> now, uh, you're going to be playing with, with Andy and Robert today, Andy, right? Andy Velo and Robert Wayne. Both right. aspiring country stars, and uh, I'm just going to sit in with them and see what I can do. Try to keep up. Try, try to teach them something. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Well, age talks, doesn't it? <laughs> okay, listen, so, uh, we're going to go back and enjoy you guys playing. Okay. Enjoy. Right. Thanks for coming. But, uh, so, we have a, a new EP coming out, and this is the, the title track off that EP. Uh, it's called Blue Collar Cruise, and uh, to kind of give you guys a little background, uh, when I was in high school, I was raised up in uh, Swanee, Georgia, which is uh, uh, on the banks of the Chattahoochee River, and uh, we used to go tubing when I was in high school, and there was one gas station where I knew we could get beer underage, and that was a Circle K in Dawsonville, and uh, so we used to stop up there and then drive up to hell, and then we'd put in, and we'd just float for a long time. And so this is the title track uh, off, that, uh, off that EP, it's called Blue Power Cruise. Can't be a clear blue Saturday. Introduce tied to a Chevrolet. Quick stop off at Circle K for a case or two of beer. You find a place to park where the black top ends. Unload the truck and jump on in. Make sure the cooler's tied off and then it's all down the river from here. Floating along on hydropower, 1.12 miles an hour. Soaking up the summer sun, kicking back, drinking cold ones with a redneck kind of attitude. In a patched up old inner tube, ain't first class, but it'll do for a blue collar crew. Party rock's already rocking out, blasting that boombox good and loud. All that beer, there ain't no doubt, they're already lit. Yeah, this lazy whole river's just what I need. Ain't nowhere else I'd rather be. Got my copper tone girl right next to me, stealing her little caps. Yeah, we're just floating along on hydropower. 1.12 miles an hour Soaking up the summer sun Kicking back, drinking cold ones With a redneck kind of attitude In a patched up old inner tube Ain't first class, but it'll do For a blue collar crew Yeah, life's good when you let it flow. Easy come, easy go. Who knew fun could be so slow? Floating along on hydropower, 1.12 miles an hour. Soaking up the summer sun. Kicking back, drinking cold ones with a redneck kind of attitude. Yeah. Ashed up old inner tube Ain't first class but it'll do For a blue collar cruise A blue collar cruise Yeah, yeah. A blue collar cruise Hey, when does that EP go up? I don't know. <laughs>
How you doing? How you doing? Uh, if anybody doesn't know, this is T. Bob Bechtel, and uh, you're out of Pensacola, right? Pensacola Beach, just right down the street. Uh, Same island. <laughs> uh, why don't you tell everybody a little bit about yourself? Well, I'm a comedian by trade, but I just happen to love this particular type of music. I want to hear the people that wrote the music sing it. Uh, I started in Nashville with it when I was uh, when it was called Guitar Pulls, and then it became Artists in the Round, and nowadays it's Songwriter Festivals. Yeah. And uh, I'm a comedian on the Grand Ole Opry in Nashville. Hey, I took me in there when Jerry Clower uh, left us, and I've uh, I just I'm in the music business. I'm a comedian, but I'm in the music business. Uh -huh. You know, in country music, uh, you're in the music business, whatever you do. You know? Yeah, yeah. And uh, I've uh, I've been appearing on the Grand Ole Opry now for uh, almost 20 years, and uh, it's uh, it's just something I wanted to do for the area. I wanted to give our local songwriters, which we are very deep and rich in talent around here, a showcase, a place to display their talents. And we brought in the guys from Nashville. We got guys from Key West and California, and all the way from Hawaii that are original songwriters. And this is our second year, and we're building, and it's going to get better. Yeah, okay. Well, you've got a great crowd today, beautiful weather. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank God for that. We, we're we on a bumper season. We never know what we're going to get. Okay, now for you guys watching that's not here today or tomorrow, you make sure and come on down next year because it's even going to be bigger. Absolutely. It's going to grow. It's going to grow. I've never seen one of these not get big. Yeah. 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 Okay. People love to hear the people that wrote the music singing. All right. Yeah. Thank, thanks a lot. Thank you very much. Story on the song, Mr. Watt. So uh, there's, a, there's a very vivid picture with it. And uh, we were playing in uh, a little small town called Macomb, Mississippi. And there, was a, there was a club out there, and uh, which was really funny because this club was like 1,100 people capacity, and it was in the middle of a field. And so you just drove up, and then here was this club. And uh, so it was me and Sammy Kershaw out there one night, and uh, we, uh, I'm never going to forget this, ever. Um, so I was playing, and there was this girl and this guy, and they were standing directly in front of the microphone, and the place was packed with people, but I could just, I, I don't know, I was so fixated on this relationship that was happening right here, and the guy looked like he was maybe, you know, 20, 21 years old, and he looked like a typical blue collar guy. He kind of had some grease on his face that I think he tried to wash off, but it didn't quite come off all the way. And then he was with this girl, and uh, she was a little bit younger, like looked like 17, 18. And he had his arms around her waist, and all he could fixate on was her. Like all this stuff was going on around him, but all he was doing was just looking at her. And uh, she, on the other hand, was just looking at everything else that was going on. And you know, it's, I was, I, I thought about that for a second. It's like, you know what? She's going to get out. She's going to leave this town, and this guy is just going to just be left here. And so I wrote this song from uh, the guy's perspective, uh, and it's called Outrun the Small Town. Let somebody whisper to your pretty mind That you were better than here You ought to leave this home behind So you let your twang go Gave up on dirt and roads Oh, but baby, don't you know The city lights can burn so bright They hide your pretty red head Bury your roots up in that high rise But you came just up and forth the end Go on and get gone Leave all you want Say you won't be back around But you can't ever run this small town It ain't been the same since you took that ticket out I ain't changed, still going around and around Part of me hopes you're doing fine A bigger part of me is praying that something will change your mind The city lights can't burn so bright They 
had your pretty red head. You could bury your roots up in that high rise. But you can't just up and forget. Go on and get gone. Leave all you want. See you won't be back around. But you can't ever run this my whole town. No, not this my whole town. Yeah. This my hometown. Oh, the city lights can't burn so bright. It hides your pretty red head. Bury your roots up in that high rise. But girl, you can't just up and forget. Go on and get gone. Leave all you want. Say you won't be back around. Oh, girl, go. Go on and get gone, leave all you home, say you won't be back around. But you can't ever run this my whole town. No, you can't ever run this my whole town. No, not this my whole town. No, not this my hometown. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Andy, it's a song I wrote for my buddy who's going through some hard times, you know. And uh, I just told him, I said, man, I'll be your umbrella, man. If stuff starts happening, it starts raining or whatever, I'll, I'll, I'll open up an umbrella. And, Keep you, keep you safe and warm, so uh, it's called the rains. So you've had another bad day. It seems you've lost your dream somehow. Well, we all live and learn from our mistakes. And we carry on somehow. When the pot of gold that you chase. Seems too far for you to reach Don't let the rain wash your dreams away Yeah, just carry on somehow Yeah, just carry on somehow I'm in the world, you will catch you I'll catch you before you hit the ground I'll be the one to embrace Stop. 